A lot of you are going to go, those are effing ugly, Karen. I don't like them. Gifting suite at Cos. <laughs> to go I picked out my pieces good and just cinch it. This closes here, it's got big shoulders and then you kind of just cinch it. You can't really tell but it has ties and when you tie it it goes like this at the waist with oversized shoulders. So good. I love it. The bomber is a yes. I love it. You can't really tell but the sleeves are so full in a really good way. It almost acts like a short coat in a way. This is just perfect. I thought it was going to be too long, but I'm actually okay with it being this long. I think it's so good. I'll link it below. I'll link everything below. <laughs> It's super lightweight. It feels like nothing. This is how it looks. With the waist, you can see some detail of it. It's so pretty. I don't have anything like it. It looks so nice, just like actually like this. Sort of on the waist with a cropped top, similar to how I'm wearing, you know, this right now. Long sleeved. Oh, that would look nice with it. And then just wear a pair of nice boots. Oops, brighten this up a little bit. So that's really nice. What are we thinking? Right? Super full, very light. Does not have pockets, I have to say. But I can make an exception to the rule because I just think it's so heavily discounted and it's a beautiful piece. Never owned anything by them before. Look at my arse sticking out. <laughs> so I thought it was nice. Anyway. Let me know what you think. Hello, my loves. So, I am heading to a fitting. Is it fitting? Yeah, I'm heading to a fitting. And it's for Dorothy Schumacher. I'm actually wearing their coat. 
You may remember this from Milan and New York Fashion Week. I was wearing it a lot. It's like a blanket shawl coat and I love it. It's going to be at the Greenwich Hotel, which is literally across the street. So I'll take you with me. We're in the Tribeca actually. So I'll turn you around. It's a lovely day today. It's gorgeous. Right here. Oh my gosh, look. Look how gorgeous. I love it here. Oh, I have to remember this. So I'm looking through the pieces here. Look at this a gorgeous dress. Look at the colour. It's this gorgeous green. You can see there. And then moving across, we have more here. It's that same in the but in the top. And loving the colours as well. See this? It's almost like my my coat. And then we have blue, then this inky navy, which is gorgeous. Look at that. With a good heel. Look at this. Also with a simple white top, it's like amazing. It's really one of the God, pieces. That's great. I just tried this on. This set trouser set and it's gorgeous like a lime chartreuse, chartreuse green yellow this is probably the truest color of it i really like it it's like a boxy cropped jacket with the front pockets and the matching trouser it's so good it's so good this dress is everything look look at this oh it's so slinky i love it this is definitely the one it's super like high here on the neck which i love look at the sleeves look at that i love that just really it's got like ruching on here detail and on the sleeves not sure if you can see that um the way it just hugs the body and it's got like length to it as well can you see how long it is oh it's just so good <laughs> this is gonna be so cool fashion week I'm at Carolyn Herrera and I'm trying on this, it's either a top or a dress. <laughs> I'm not sure which one it is, but I love it. Look at the structure of it. I actually like it over my jeans, like a wide leg silhouette. So, this is so pretty. Just left Carolyn Herrera and I picked up the piece that I'll be wearing and it'll be on Monday this Monday coming definitely check on my Instagram because you'll see especially on my stories and hopefully my TikTok as well you're gonna see exactly how I ended up styling this piece uh, I'm gonna head home now so I can show you some of the pieces I've picked up that I bought for myself or I've had since last year or this year that I'm gonna be also bringing with me to fashion week by the way this weather is so bizarre one minute it's really cold the next minute it is it's mild again i wonder if everyone's getting sick it's myself and Hindu. i'm back now and i'm going to show you some other pieces that um, I've just got that either the new pieces and some are just older pieces that like you've already seen before, but I want to incorporate them for fashion week. So in no particular order, I'm gonna start with something you've already seen before, which is those Versace shoes. These are definitely gonna be part of outfits for evenings out and suspecting that kind of thing. It's these ones, they are ridiculously high, pointy. They're like the, I feel like they're the bad bitch version of the Valentino's platforms. So yeah, so those are gonna come with me with the triple strap. I love them, I love these. So these are definitely gonna be coming with me. So I feel like they just really like, take it up several notches when you put these on. Another no stranger to my Instagram, at least you've seen, you've seen them before already if you follow me there, which is my Jimmy Choo boots. I picked these up in September 2002. So last year, September time, picked this up in Milan, fell in love with them, is when they literally just came out. And I have, I love them to pieces. I've always wanted a, a really mirror looking type shine boot. And this is it. 
I actually still looking for a silver version to this so if anyone has seen one please let me know or show me um, links in the comments below I'm not looking for like a foil type I'm looking for this this kind of glossy smooth you can see your reflection I mean, look at my fingers you can see literally the reflection of my fingers in the boot that's the kind of finish I'm looking but in silver so if you see a 41 holler at your girl because I'm looking still but that's for silver but these are coming with me these are the Jimmy Choo Blake boots these are as well as the shoes are still available online everything I'm showing in this video I'm going to link it below as long as I know that it is available or at least something that's close to it but I know these are available so I'll link these below these are actually now on sale if I'm, I'm almost positive I got my true size they are comfortable considering um, that they are a heel, but the heel is not ridiculously high, and that's why I love them so much. Right, so there's these. I love a good metallic though for winter. Like, I feel like with winter clothing, I feel like metallic, it just, it's almost like a pair of sunglasses when you start wear something that's metallic. It just has that effect. Anyway, so the next thing I'm gonna show you is this bag, and it is by Bottega, and I found it at Fashion File. I actually went down to their showroom it's on, I think it's 26th Street in Manhattan. So I went over there and yeah, they had this. I haven't been there in a while and I just fell in love with it. I actually saw it first on the website and then I saw it in person actually on the sh in the showroom and I just fell in love with it. I've actually always liked the silver version, but it's like the zebra clutch that I have from there, which I will show you on the screen. I'm also bringing that with me to Fashion Week, this clutch. That is coming with me. My mate Sabina was selling hers and she sold it to me. So this is actually her clutch. She didn't want it anymore. Bottega doesn't make this clutch anymore. It's about two seasons, three seasons, four seasons old. I never forgot it and loved it. So I love that clutch. And I love this particular one as well. So this is also going to be one of the pieces that's coming with me. I do not own anything like this silver. I don't own a silver metallic. I have a gold metallic that I got from Etsy and I love that. So that is also going to be coming with me. I'll see if I can find pictures of it. Yeah, that is definitely coming with me as well. But this is so cool. I just look at that. Even like with what I'm wearing, just to kind of like dress it down. I might say dress it down to dress it up <laughs> this by the way is from walmart this is the jumper that just keeps on giving margella jeans walmart top knit i have this in three colors because i love it that much please go onto the description box and thank me later get this bloody thing i think it's like is it 30 dollars 40 30 i have it purple i have it in um gray and I have it in black and it's so good. When I wear it on Instagram stories, a lot of you send me messages saying, where's that from? It's Walmart, but look at the sleeve. It's not, I'm digressing. This is probably gonna come with me as well, just to travel with and to wear because it's super warm. It's soft, it's thin, and it's slouchy enough just to, to like to tuck in. That actually rhymed. This is coming with me for sure. Okay, and then this is going to be the one that I'll, a lot of you, if you've not seen my YouTube shorts, then this is gonna be a shock to you, as well as TikTok is gonna be a shock to you if you've not seen that either, because I posted it on there first. I'm just gonna get out of the way. These, yeah, they're boots, and they're coming with me too. These are so badass. I know how eclectic they are, and a lot of you are gonna go, those are effing ugly, Karen, I don't like them. And I've had a bunch of you already say that, but you know what, I've always said that your style should be true to you and whatever you love wear it don't give a f what anyone else thinks and that's exactly how i feel about fashion in general and i love these two pieces they are called the loewe flamingo boots michael calls them my drawstring purses or drawstring pouches they are basically a take on the loewe flamingo bag which i'll show you right here so it has a signature front and back tassel this is them close up they are effing amazing and like I said, a lot of you will probably just think, what the F are those? So good. They have an inner shoe as well. So this is just like an outer piece to show. And you can like just kind of like use a toggle to like pull them in very slightly on each foot. I love the sole of them, that heel, just this, that whole vibe of how it just, the leather starts from here and goes up. It's just like a not very non-traditional type of boot but still really badass at the same time so that's why I love these I think it's one of those things that you know like I said you either love it or hate it but I think they're great and that's that's all that matters isn't it all right next thing oh my god 
oh but these are so good oh look at them look at that leather look at that smooshy leather and yes they are comfortable god they're so good Another piece that's coming with me is this skirt by Christopher John Rogers. I picked it up from Netta Porte on their sale. I have this skirt already in a neon green and I love it. I'll show you here on the other side, that skirt. So good, it's beautiful, really good quality. I love long pleated skirts anyway. That's like my jam. I mean, the Holston Heritage one, that gold, right, thrifted vintage one, the Frankie Shop ones that I got recently in metallic silver. <gasps> The metallic silver with the bag. That could be a moment. I already know from the green how much I love it. It's a beautiful, like vibrant Kelly green. And this is also a very vibrant orange. And I love that two tone, but being a little bit darker down below, really super long as well. It really does like graze the tops of my feet. It's that long. And I love that, that drama, it's so full gorgeous swish when I'm walking so this is another piece I can't wait to style yeah I just can imagine like a, a completely like orange on orange like a tonal moment or going the opposite way and teaming it with even with gold because it's gonna look I could imagine it even with gold it's really anyway so yeah so I picked this up great I love the green now I have it in the orange and I think it's fantastic. I got this in a size six, and I feel like it does run pretty true. This is one of those things that if you love pleated skirts as just as much as I do, this is one of those skirts that you're just gonna keep forever in your wardrobe. So that's that's why I got it, because I love the green version. So now I've got this one as well. I just realized that my pleated skirts are all like really statements. You know, they're not just like neutral black or beige. They're all like a statement like this, and you know, the gold metallic. It's interesting just 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 that literally just dawned on me okay i have to bring this jacket with me how good is this right this is a piece that i found this jacket from instagram you probably already remember this proenza scooter so happy to find this i found this designer consignment shop the real real that's where i got this and i just love it the cropped boxy cut is perfect it's it's that good and just that tiger print or zebra print i think i feel like it's tiger because of the the color combination so we'll go with that it fits so beautifully and i'm so so glad that i got it it's a piece that i know that had i not seen it at the real real i would never own this because i just happened to be in there and i was going through and they had it and i just thought this is job done i even like it with this i didn't mean to style this together but this is a slip dress that i've had it's green and it's from i think this was from zara i can't remember I think it's from Zara. Anyway, look at that, that combination. Doesn't this look good together? The green mm -hmm. and the jacket. Yeah, I just like that together. That's an outfit, actually. Didn't realize. Mm -hmm. It's what I call a hanger outfit because I do. I ran out of hangers and so I just bummed this jacket on top of this dress hanger. That's a good idea. You just grab and go. I call it the hanger outfit. I think I just coined something <laughs> All right, so I'm going to show you two more pieces. Oh my God, I just realized this is also Proenza. I didn't even realize that until now. Wow, that's so funny. That is just a pure coincidence. These super tall, over the knee, I almost want to say almost thigh high boots. Look at that. These are redonkulous. I already showed these on TikTok. I just think they're ridiculous. I showed a sneak peek of them as well on my Instagram. They are super comfortable. I have always wanted this boot category, which is, and I own nothing like this, which is a heeled, over the knee, black, sleek boot. But I did want it to be like pretty woman high heel. I wanted it to be like a, a chic heel height. And to me, this is, it's just, it's just enough. It's like a, it's not a kitten, it's higher than a kitten heel, but to me it's, falls under the lower category of being like a high heel as well. So it's just, it's just literally just right. They stay up as well on the leg. I got a size 41 and the 41 fits me absolutely fine. Super sleek on the leg. Again, I'll show you the TikTok. They look super good on your legs. They make your legs look so long, don't they, Michael? I remember you were saying as well. Yeah, they go like all the way to my neck. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's so true. It's ridiculous. They're really leg elongating. They are faux leather as well for those who are vegan and aren't into real leather. And they're great. They have no shine to them, so they're like a nice dull matte. They look like they are leather. That toe, it's like a narrow 
squared off toe super contemporary look they just look so good i can't i can't fault them there is no hardware on them at all and it's just one long sleek leather looking black leg and that is it but anyway again i'll link these below amazing i'm so glad i have these i'm going to have these forever i think i'm going to be wearing those my god there's so many things i can wear them with dresses and i can wear them with dresses that are on the shorter side same with skirts i think that is really the main ways i'm going to be wearing those uh, maybe a oversized longer line blazer or jacket and i can wear the boot to match the bottom of that blazer or jacket just uh, they're really good and last but not least at least for now because i'm actually going to show you a couple about two or three more pieces but i'm going to save them for my newsletter which is coming out yes i do have a newsletter i know i've mentioned it a few times before it's coming out this sunday at the time of watching this video i'll leave a link for it below you need to be subscribed to my newsletter before you can actually get to see the newsletter because it goes out automatically to whoever is subscribed to it so you're going to see on there a sneak peek of two or three probably three other pieces that i'm also going to be wearing during fashion week so it's not in this video i don't even know if it's even been seen anywhere i'm not even sure but i'll put them on my newsletter for you all right so last piece for this video is going to be something by sonia black owned business amazing black woman great designer she did a collaboration with monroe steel this though is part of her permanent collection i believe it's her signature paper bag, high-waisted, wide-legged, rigid denim. Try saying that three times fast. They are absolutely amazing. First off, this is the back, and look how wide they are, right? This is the other side, I haven't taken the tag off yet, but I have tried them on. That's the front, so that's the cut of them. No hardware on these whatsoever, no zips, buttons, nothing. And it has a belt loops and a self belt that comes like this way down, this far down. And then when you put it on, it's really big, and then you just draw string in the belt, and it just does this accordion style on your waist, and does that. So it has this kind of effect. Oh, it's so good. And it literally sits right, this part is all the way up here, like where your boobs are. It's just epic, and this is like a cropped cut for the jean, for the bottom of it, it's wide leg. These are amazing, they're so good. Sonja, you just, you knocked it out of the park with these. So good, definitely wanna wear them, look at that. It even looks good over my black jumper. Oh God, this is so epic. So that is something I'm definitely gonna be rocking during fashion week, whether it's New York or Milan or for Paris, I'm not sure but definitely coming with me. So that is it, that is like a nutshell. It was a bit of a vlog in the beginning, I think, so you could see like some of the pieces that I've seen or was looking for when I was out and about, combined with going to a couple of fittings as well, because I wanted you to see that, because that happened during the week that this video is going up. So I had to throw that in so you can see sneak peeks of what I'm gonna be wearing from that. At the time of you watching this video, New York Fashion Week has basically started. So I'm going to be showing everything on my, as I did before, on my Instagram and on my TikTok. So make sure you are following on my Instagram, at Karen Britchick, the same name. Also on my Instagram stories, you'll see a lot going up in real time of where I'm going and what's happening. Also just a little bit of behind the scenes of what I'm wearing, you know, all that kind of good stuff. So that's gonna be all on my Instagram. Between this Friday and next Friday, I will see you over there so you can see what's going on. And do not forget, if you wanna see the extra pieces that I am, bringing and wearing for Fashion Week. It's gonna be in my newsletter going out this Sunday at 11 o'clock New York time. And I'll leave it in the description box. I'm done, I'm out of here. Woo! This video is being recorded right before the madness of Fashion Week month slash begins. So this is like the calm before the storm. But of course I'm going to be doing a vlog as well. I should be doing a vlog of hopefully of all the cities of New York, Fashion Week, Milan and Paris. I will try my best. I'll see how it goes, because I won't know how it's gonna go until I'm actually in it. But I will see if I'm able to do it for every single city. But I'm done, that is it my loves. Let me know your favorite piece from this entire video, not just from me sitting here, but from what I showed you earlier as well. I'll see you later, I'll see you on Instagram. Bye. <laughs>